Hello everyone, welcome back to Europa Universalis 4. My name is Cilantro. Yao just done goofed. I'm gonna come beat their face in with my damages, hopefully. Um, as soon as this claim fabrication is done, I'm gonna start fabricating another one on the last province I don't have a claim on. And I'm just gonna 1A into their faces. Hopefully blow them apart. Win a lot of prestige and power projection, hopefully. Alright. Fabricate on the last one that I have. Yeah, I wanna I wanna try to get down to here and then across so I can start heading further east. Hey, colony's done. Good. Colonize here, please. No? Yes. Colonist still coming back, I guess. Get our navy uh, consolidated once more. I'll send all the light ships out as soon as they're all gathered up there. All right, can I declare on you guys yet? Hopefully before you get an ally. I sure can. Tunis will still not come in. That's completely fine. War goal. Yeah, I'll make the war goal. Take Aider since that's probably where I'm going first. Time to run in and squash your face with my damages. And consolidate. And you guys. Man, I really should. I should probably be privateering. It will piss people off, but. Well. For now. Just keep going there. Bam, 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 bam. Oh, your troops. Oh, no. What happened to your troops, man? That really sucks. I'm so sorry, broski. That was not very nice of me. Oh, no. Your vassal's troops. <laughs> that sucks. Uh, He's actually almost better than my general. Keep the general for now. Hiring a lot of mercs there, buddy? Or just those just regular troops? Probably just regular troops. That is great news. France going for some more colonial conquest. That is fine. Twelve noble regiments. Gal gets powerful noble. Sixteen thirty four. I don't want to deal with that right now. I'd rather just have one fairly mediocre uh, province for a while. Naval liber eh, not really super important. I'm anxious to see what maritime ideas finish off. I think you can actually change your government at some point as well to a sort of maritime government. I'm not sure how that works. You guys going to air? I bet you are. You're going to air to try to siege it, aren't you? Yep, you sure are. Too bad it's a disaster for you. I don't care how awesome your general is. You're not going to win that fight. Bam, it, bam, it, bam. Get out of here. All right. You go siege the capital. You go siege that fort. We'll wrap this up. Let me see how I can. Let me see how I can dice these guys up. Hope the westernization was worth it, buddy. We can do that. That way, I can grab this land as well. Grab you and you. Perfect.
Yep, that'll work. Burn him at the stake. Okay, I want the losing of the prestige. It's fine. I want low piety still. I know I'm at negative prestige, but that's going to be changing very quickly. Oh, ringing the old doorbell, huh, yo? Yeah, see, that's the problem. It doesn't work that way. That's not how this works. Okay, buddy. I'm sorry. That's just not, that's not how I do business. Just not how I do business. Actually, I wonder if I can do this slightly differently to get... Where all do I actually have claims? Uh, Tenere. I have a claim in Tenere. Can grab that instead. We'll make it a little cheaper. Do that. Save him a little bit of land. I can get some more extra perks from that. Get some cash. 145. Oh, took the stupid fort. I hate that. Um, I could grab war reps then. Get some extra prestige. How much prestige am I going to get from this anyway? Only 17? Eh. Only 35 power projection as well. Going to need more Diplo power to actually do it. Oh well. What can you do? Portugal's still going to war with people. Got my capital. I got their capital, rather. Go crush these guys. Alright, before this fort's garrison gets too big, let's go siege it. Should have unmothballed the fort. I should have should have should have known better. Actually, let's split up. Time to start carpet sieging. Mongolia, eh? Mongolia no longer exists or something? Or do they westernize? Uh, they seem not to exist. That must be like the only thing actually giving them war score right now. Is that castle, that fort being there. Alright, go siege that crap down, please. All right, I think we're I think we're good to to get our demands. Eighty three. Yep, looks pretty good to me. We have our feeler over to the east, taking a lot of stuff. We have our claims. Overextension is only 61%. <laughs> oh no, y'all might join a coalition against me, guys. Excellent. Expansion step one. And we get our manpower recovery. Prestige goes up to one. Hooray. Uh, yeah, I guess Mazab's not really doing us much good not being incorporated in, huh? Tyrant Overlord? Really? I guess there's really no way for me to annex them because it's 190 and I had enough trouble getting to 190 before. Although I think with your I think with your vassals you can actually improve up to 200. Let's try it. Um protect our brethren in Dendi. Where's that? Better than playing Dota 2. Ah Golia Tenga. Not allied with uh, Mali anymore. They're allied with Nupe and Bonaman. Bonaman. Nupe, you are allied with Mosi and Yatenga. Mosi is allied with Nupe. So, we're going to have to go for one of these fights, I would imagine. 
Wow, what a terrible name placement. Look at that. <laughs> How the hell does that work? Lodia is currently at war with the doll. That's fine. Yeah, I'm gonna definitely start conquering east. Oh, the old Otterinos. What an alliance. I would love that. That is not bad. Hello, Otterinos. Also under a regency. Regiment costs. Make them a little cheaper. Want a royal marriage as well? I would love that. Thank you. All right. Colony self-sustaining. You guys go colonize here. Please, please do. And I'll take that. We may be going for that mission. That might not be a bad idea. Oh, I gotta check to see what all is getting made. Hate that. Okay, so it looks like nothing else is getting made. You gotta be careful about that. People will make troops. And then when you take their territory, those troop construction orders still go through, which I find kind of annoying, personally. I should probably core this stuff, too. That may not be a bad idea, as I did just conquer it. I don't want to have overextension. So let's let's take care of that. Hey, natives. I can't. <laughs> That's a lot of military power. I think I'd rather do that than park a stupid guy there, though. Okay, so Nupe has a vassal. Wanka! <laughs> Alright, I'm coming after you, Wanka. Your ally was Oyo, who is nobody. Molly, are you ready to die now? I think he might be ready to die. Well, there's no, no point in leaving my guy in France anymore. Considering France hates me. They rivaled me. Cost of doing business, I suppose. I could just park my guys there for now. It's fine. I would like to recover a little bit of manpower before I go to the next war. Okay, so I still have the uh, I still have the show superiority CB against Molly, so that's good. Let me cancel my military access. Thank you. Spare no expenses. Actually, how is our... Okay, inflation's... It's getting handled. It's getting handled. I'm making nine ducats a turn now. Or a month. I just want to call them turns. What are, what kind of trade goods do we have here? Lots of... We got iron. Dyes are kind of valuable. I guess I didn't really take too many valuable provinces when I did that, huh? Yeah, it's alright. That's alright. Whoops. I want to kill these guys off. Sorry, natives. I want you to be constantly dealing with that because you're you're going to be directly inhibiting my conquest into Elodia, which I can't be having that. <laughs> Britain needs to doing some colonization. That's kind of funny. All right, you guys head over here towards Mali, and let's get ready to start crushing them. They are only allied with Oyo, who is not exactly the biggest biggest country out there. Uh, we have another colony actually finishing very soon. I wonder if I can colonize this or not. I don't know if I can already reach there. You're allied with Genoa and Kaffa. Interesting. Um, naval maintenance modifier plus 5%. 5.45 ducats, so... Yeah, there's no way it's going to cost more than that. Oh, right. Rebels. I always forget about that when I conquer new territory. 
Got a lot of different rebels. Ooh. Well, that kind of sucks. All right, so here's what we're going to do. We're just going to increase autonomy. Everywhere that I conquered, I do not want to deal with rebels because I'm going to be... I want to be aggressively, literally aggressively expanding through here. So rather than deal with that, we're just going to increase autonomy all over the place. Yep. Yep. That'll make that significantly easier to handle. Yeah, none of these are going to want to go now. Connie and Yuchi has grown enough to become self-sustaining. Excellent. Dara, huh? Where are you? Oh, okay. That's good. How long before these become cord, actually? It's another thing I need to watch out for, obviously, is my... Um, stability. Okay, so we still have a ways to go yet. I guess I, I guess I don't need to jump into war yet. I should just be ready to do so. Okay, colonialism CB goes away. That's fine. Probably from the continuing colonization down here, likely causing all those to continue popping up. Lots of colonial conquest. Portuguese Mexico is expanding nicely. Aztecs still exist, somehow. Well, let me see if I can actually colonize here yet. I can't, because I can't see it. Well, let's go see that place. With the worst... <laughs> it's so bad. Man, ha not having army tradition really sucks. Hopefully I'll start making enough money here to be able to... Well, you know what? If I'm making 10 ducats a, t uh, a month, I can probably handle... At least keeping my forts active. It'll help my... It'll help my army tradition a little bit. Not going to be great, but better. Certainly better. Actually, I have enough power projection to handle an extra leader without upkeep for some time, so that'll work. Better to have some sort of leader than none. If that doesn't work, I may colonize here so I can start pushing up this way. You know, I, I probably should be not... Actually, now would be the time to keep a good eye out on places like Aragon. Still out of Portugal. The Ottomans would not come in. Oh, my God. Get out of your debt, bro. I need you as an ally. I want to pull you in. I could easily win this war with the Ottomans on my side. Could take Aragon, force them to break their stuff with Portugal, take a bunch of Portugal's stuff. That would be huge, actually. Yeah, I'm going to have to keep a very close eye on that. For sure. Yes, yes, yes. I'm actually getting kind of annoyed by the Colonial Conquest CB pop-up all the time. We get it. <laughs> I get it already. Okay, so I can't... Yeah. Can't colonize there, so I'll colonize there instead. Oh, they're getting beat up by these noble rebels. You know what that is? It's probably from westernization. That would be my guess. Oh, same thing here. I bet you that's why these guys are having noble rebels as well. So now might be the time to attack. I would imagine my yeah my core construction will easily be done by that time. So I want to make sure all my troops are there. Chinook. 
Alright. Kill the natives really quickly. So I have no issues there. And you guys head over this way. Actually, what would it cost me to support them? Really? So is this is this just bugged or something? Why can't I send? Oh, I guess I, I guess I can't support them. Six ducats a month for those allies. Let's do it. Okay, that is a lot of allies. Holy moly! That's what you get for westernizing, bro. It's kind of interesting to use westernization as a pretext, essentially, for war. That is crazy. Probably eventually need to deal with those guys, but uh, let's see here. I'm gonna send somebody to organize a response. All right. Um, yeah, let's pull back from the Zob. So we'll be able to get that actually up to the max and then in integrate them, hopefully. Oh, they're at minus three. St yeah, they must have just started westernizing. Minus three stability. Hey, buddies. How you guys doing? Enforce rebel demands. All right. Uh, we're going to get into this war next session of Europe Universal's 4. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.